we'll talk about. Oh, I should probably. Okay, sorry, I was closing my glue stick. So today I started this, The Artist's Way by Julia Cameron, which if you watch journaling videos and you're part of the journaling community or just like the creative community on YouTube, you might have heard this about this book. It, it's where Morning Pages came from. A lot of people talk about Morning Pages and it comes from this book. But it's actually a 12-week course about, like, discovering your creative self. Like, recovering from kind of like the negative things we say to ourselves that stem from childhood that keep us from creating. It's a lot of, like, inner child work, which I'm super into. You guys probably would know that if you've been on watching my channel for a while so I'm I'm doing this I'm doing this I started today I read week one and I want to do some of the exercises including the morning pages but I didn't want to do it in my current journal because if a journal is like I like it or whatever or if it's decorated pretty or it was like I bought it and I don't know, I, like, I feel guilty ruining it <laughs> if it's, like, nice. Um, it's kind of hard. So, for morning pages, you basically just write stream of conscious writing. Sorry, <laughs> I have all these things in here. Um, so, you have to do that every day when you do this course. So, I just decided that I was going to use this old five-star notebook that I've had in my closet forever and I haven't used yet. There's lots of other exercises and kind of like art prompt, art like prompts and stuff, things to draw. So I like this because I could write my morning pages in it and I could like write reflections and do the little exercises. But then when I do an, an art thing, I could uh, do an art thing on this sketch pad paper and then just glue it in so everything can be together. I'm very excited about doing The Artist's Way. I've had this book. I think I got this book for my birthday in July. So I'm really excited and I really enjoyed reading the first few parts. So I'm going to be working on this over the break. My feet are falling asleep. This is something else I've been doing. You guys might know that I've been getting into knitting. Uh, oh no. Okay, I'll fix that. But I've been really getting into knitting. And for some reason, I started knitting these like little octopuses. <laughs> Octopi. They don't really look like anything. Like They look like just ugly dolls. Like weird dolls. But I made this one. And I was going to make it for my friend. But I thought it came out kind of not that good uh so and I also kind of loved it so I decided to keep this one for myself and yarn just got undone from it but I'll fix that and I named it hemp seed and I just think it looks like a little hippie uh octopus I don't really know and then I've been knitting ones like this so trying to I don't know, it's kind of like a different kind of style, as you can see. I don't know, it's pretty much the same. This one is just knit a little bit differently. A little more square than rounded. And I've been putting little hats on them and little scarves. And I have different buttons and pom-poms and stuff. And I'm uh, mailing these to friends for Christmas. Friends that like live far away. Or I've been up making them just for like people <laughs> like I don't know my dance teacher or like my friends well my friends are dance teachers because I work at a ballet company but yeah just random people in my life that I want to give a little gift to I've been making these so if you want one of these let me know and maybe I'll just like pick a few people randomly and just send them 
Is this a giveaway? I've never done a giveaway. If you want to win one of these, just write a comment and like and subscribe. Is that how people do these? Yes. And I will send you your own little ugly knit octopus. <laughs> so yeah, I got that going on. And then I also have been really interested in making peg dolls. So I got these from Michaels. They're like little undone wooden peg dolls. And I have a bunch of um, felt. I have more up there on my bed because I have a lot of other things, that projects and stuff. So yeah, I want to paint these and make them into fairies or something and get them little hair, yarn hair. 